got to get ready because we have we start Big Ten play next week, you know. So we got another challenge in uh, Minnesota next week, and we just got to be prepared to go and have a good week of practice and go to Minnesota. Mackenzie Milton hurt you with his arm and his legs today. What was the toughest part of trying to get to him? What was he able to take advantage of? Uh, he was able to, like you said, he was able to use his feet very well today, you know. We knew he was a... Uh, uh, he was a very capable quarterback of scrambling, you know, but we didn't do a great job of, of keeping him inside the pocket. You know, that was one of our, 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 our keys is to keep him in the pocket because we wanted to make him, make him beat us in the pocket. But we obviously didn't do a great job of that. Jermaine, we've seen a couple weeks ago. How difficult is it just as a leader of the team to see your starter go down again? Oh, well, it's difficult, but like I said, you know, we just had to be – uh, prepare for any situation, you know, it's football, that's the nature of the game, you know, people get hurt in football, you know, it's like a 99% injury rate, something like that, so it's something that happens all around the country, we just have to be prepared and we have to be better next week, you know, like I said, no matter what the situation is, if the team comes back, if he doesn't, you know, we just have to be ready. My choice of the emotion of it, how much was it in terms of the offense sort of not, you know, sort of stalling um, without, without Kasim and, and, the, and stuffing the runs? that sort of tired out the defense. You guys were on the field a lot. Uh, we were on the field a lot, but like you, like like I said, like I mentioned, we have to be better, you know, no matter what the situation. Every time we're on the field, we're expected to to make a stop, you know, no matter what the situation is. Uh, so uh, that's, that, that's my take on it. I can make your hands clap.